section all the way off. Yes, sir. And we out. <laughs> Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it Please none of the talks, I heard enough of it Like, what you gon' do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really bout this, don't talk about it Really on the move, on the map, never slip Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it Real eyes, real lies, real lies All the time, stand on it If we said it, we don't walk around it Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips New phone, who this? No, we don't allow it Really on goal, I don't know what's an off day Now we on road, came from Yo, it is good, John Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions It's your boy J.I. And I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys Now, as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail We are going on the first drive in Vader After I put the drag pack on the car Oh, damn, that's crazy how we pulling out the parking lot right now HPD just... And they staring, sheesh. They was staring hard as hell, bro. I don't even know if I want to go this way anymore. Um, but yeah, man. Um, just put the drag pack on, man. We're finna go ahead and try to see if, you know, I can feel a difference um, from, you know, the VMS wheels that I had borrowed from Frankie. If you guys remember those videos back when we were going to the drag strip trying to get the best time out of the car. Um, you know, I actually took the seats out of the car um, and put the drag pack on and we ran a 11.7 in the quarter mile and I believe a 7.6 or 7.5 in the eighth mile um, on that setup. And I really did like the VMS setup. I liked the way that it looked on the car, but I'm not going to lie, man. I needed me some welts. Um, I've always loved the style that I got right now. Um, so it just was a no brainer when it came to, you know, deciding if I was going to get them or not. Um, so with that being said, we're going to go ahead and go head off to a different location. I'll give you guys a quick little walk around of what the car looks like and um, how it's been, you know, how it's sitting on these tires and wheels. You know what I mean? Suspension has finally settled a little bit. Got a C8 going by. Okay, okay. Um, but yeah, the suspension has settled a little bit. So we should, you know what I'm saying, be at the car's, you know, final ride height on these wheels. So we'll be able to see, you know, what it looks like finally for real, for real. Um, but yeah, man. Also, I'm going to get a couple, you know, test pulls in. Just make sure that we're hooking. You know, that was the whole point of getting the drag pack. Um, because I can't hook on the stocks. Um, we all knew that. And I knew we need to get some new tires for the stocks too, but it's okay. So right now, you know, I was going to give her a little bit of the beans, but since HPD is so gracefully just cruising in front of us right now, um, I think we're going to chill uh, until we get to that spot, man. So, you know. Just a quick little POV for you guys. What it's like sliding in Vader, man. You know what I mean? Nothing crazy. Doing the speed limit and whatnot. Driving in Houston is a pain, bro. Now y'all can see. Like, <laughs> bro, I'm doing the speed limit and going over these bumps and all that, man. Y'all see what I be talking about, man. Houston has probably some of the worst roads um, that I've driven on, honestly, and it's just ridiculous. <laughs> and they are showing no signs of fixing them. At least the roads that actually need to be fixed, like this one. Every road that you see them doing construction on barely has any potholes or any dips and stuff like that, like this one does. So it's literally just a waste of the tax money, but it is what it is. Pulling up to this quick little like warehouse type vibe type you feel me Let's see if we can get Vader and get you guys some pops real quick I don't want to burn the spot but I do want to just do one little launch just one little launch one little launch 2k oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh yeah, bro. What? Bro. Bro, what? Oh yeah, bro. These joints. Yeah. And I got like 25 pounds of air in them right now. But these are definitely what I needed. So we finna finna pull off to the side right here. Get you guys a quick little walk around, man. Cause I'm not even gonna lie. I these joints hooking too good, bro. Sheesh. Need a wheel turn. Oh yeah, I can smell that rubber. Definitely can <laughs> definitely can smell that rubber, bro. East, bro, Vader, man. And you know we went ahead and put that tow hook on there, got rid of that front license plate. Y'all, let me know down in the comment section down below what y'all think. That front license plate being gone and having the tow hook on there, bro. I personally love it, man. And then we got the big, the big boys back there, man. You feel me? Sheesh! Oh my God, bro, like. This car just looks so good on any drag pack, to be honest. Like, I really don't think you can go wrong when it comes to selecting a drag pack for these joints, bro. Because, man, bro, this car looks insane right now, y'all. I'm not even going to lie. I just need to throw, like, some tire shine on there, man. You feel me? Get it all lip glossed up and whatnot. Maybe wipe it down before the meet tonight. But, dude, oh, my God. God, sheesh, bro, y'all don't understand how long I've been wanting a set of welts for this car, for any of my cars, honestly, ever since I've seen welts, I always wanted to get them, man, I'm sorry, I know I told y'all we was gonna do like a quick walk around and go get some pulls in, but dude, I am obsessed with this setup, bro, and we don't even have the front skinnies yet, we just got the rears, and sheesh, I do have my eyes on a set of front skinnies, but they're not welts, so I don't know how it's going to look. I think it's still going to come out clean, but I'm not sure. I just love that on the welds, you can see the 1LE on the caliper just peeking through, man. It looks so good, man. It looks so good. Then you go to the front, you know, you see them big six pistons up front through that stock 1LE wheel, and it just... Sheesh, man. Oh, my God. Y'all don't understand, bro. Like, I am really in love with the way that the car is sitting right now, bro. For real, for real. And I know I told you guys, you know, I was thinking about doing, you know, the lowering springs from Eibach, um, and having that little, I think it's like an inch and a half in the rear and an inch in the front of a drop. But after, you know, doing some consideration and talking to a couple of the homies, man, it literally just wouldn't make sense for me to mess with the suspension on the 1LE when it's literally perfect. You know what I'm saying? It is literally dialed in perfectly from Chevy to do exactly what it's supposed to do. And that's perform. That's take these turns crazy. That's get these best lap times. You know what I'm saying? So I, I really don't want to mess with it. And then also, if I do go lower all the way around, it's going to mess up my 60 foot time. I'm definitely going to get slower in the 60 foot, which will definitely correlate to a slower run in the quarter mile. And that's not what we want at all. We want straight dubs. You feel me? So I'm sorry, y'all. I know. I know. I done walked around this joint so many times, but bro, like, it's just hard to look at this car knowing, like, what I was dreaming about, and then, you feel me, it's here. So, it's just, it's really hard right now for me to just, like, kind of do this video, to be honest with y'all, because it's like, I'm really speechless, and I need to be talking to y'all for the video. So, <laughs> it's a little, it's a little... It's a little crazy, man. I'm not going to lie. I don't even... I might just have to end it here. I, I might do another pull or something like that. I don't know. I just... All right, bro. Let's just get in the car. Let's just get in the car. Because I'm just going to keep looking at it. Let's just get back in the car. Ugh. Let's just get back in the car, man. Let's go. Let's go see what West Timer are hitting for. As y'all can see, we definitely need gas. But I'm on 93 right now. I'm trying to run out that last little bit of 93 out the tank. And then fill it up with some E85. Um, you know what I'm saying? So it'd be straight E. 
You know, I'm gonna have a little bit of a mixture going on because of the 93 that's still gonna be in the lines, but at least it'll be full on E. I've actually been riding around on 93, y'all, just because E85 burns crazy. E85 burns so fast. It's insane. It literally burns fast as hell. I don't understand it. Now, yeah, don't get me wrong. You know what I'm saying? My car definitely is faster on E. About 30 to 40 horsepower gain on E85. But it is not worth. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want no smoke, my boy. <laughs> you do not want no smoke, gangster. I ain't even gonna cap. I I really hope the camera picked that up. I was not like playing no games. This joint just got sideways on me with the drag pack on the back. <laughs> boy, I told you I got 25 pounds of air back there, bro. I'm pretty sure that's a little too much um, for these tires. Plus, they're still cold. Man, jeez, I don't know. I've, I'm still debating if I should even. Okay, I'm just not gonna launch it. We'll we'll kind of roll into it a little bit. Forty. Yeah. And then y'all hear that joint? I don't know. I don't know if it's better with the windows down or with the windows up, but bro, dude, yeah, it hooks in books, bro. That was y'all saw what it was. I don't. <laughs> y'all saw what it was. Let me let me let me put this on that for y'all. You know what I'm saying? So that'll help y'all out a little bit, a little bit better with keeping up with the the speed, because the speedo just be moving. You can't really track that too much. Bro, it's like the front end lifts up, bro. <laughs> Look at his face. He <laughs> broke the fuck out of his neck. <laughs> bro, it's like legit. The front end of the car lifts up whenever I get on it a little bit. And that is by no means... <laughs> floored bro that's just me blipping the throttle and like getting into it a little bit bro that is wow <laughs> i'm not even gonna lie to y'all like bro vader vader is definitely a completely different car on this nrg tune and paired with the drag pack back there actually you know what i'm saying hooking a little bit and getting into it you know at least not in a turn it's obviously gonna you know get a little sideways on a turn no traction um a whole bunch of torque on a drag radio that's cold you feel me but just blipping the throttle like getting into it even that baby launch that i did back there in that parking lot like bro the front end legit like you huh and then it puts you back in the seat i Bro, I I am in love with this car, bro. Like y'all don't understand how much work went into getting here, bro. If there's anything in life that you want to do, anything in life that you want, bro, do not let nobody tell you that you cannot have it or that you cannot get it, bro. All you gotta do is put your head down, lose all distractions and just focus on that goal and i guarantee you you'll get there bro like it may not be on your time it's nine times out of ten not gonna be on your time you feel me but if you continue to grind and continue to push and work for it you'll definitely get it eventually bro and that's with anything in life but right now we're about to hit one of my favorite little kind of like twisty roads and we're gonna see what this what you know what i'm saying the 1le gonna do on this drag pack and some and some turns if i can get like a good enough amount of distance between me and this this s450 in front of me then we can definitely get this joint ready uh definitely get some pulls or something you know what i'm saying so i don't
don't have nobody behind me right now so i'm kind of gonna just drop back a little bit that way i can create some space and we can kind of take these turns a little a little more aggressive for y'all man okay okay a little snack a little wide body snack over there no kizzy Not gonna lie this road at night when it's empty and there's nobody on it is probably one of the funnest roads that i've been on in houston so far because it's like it's almost like a little bit of i guess this is like a little bit of houston's kind of like version of tell of the dragon out there in atlanta um which is a course that i really really want to take Vader on bro just to I feel like I can really push the car's limits for real on that on that course make sure nobody going give it a little bit of juice just a little bit Let me uh, let me go ahead and chill out, bro. I'm finna just, I'm, I'm finna chill out. I'm gonna go get me something to eat. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up here. We are gonna turn, go ahead and roll that outro. If you're new to the channel, hit that like button. Turn on those post notifications. Hit that subscribe button, man. Drop a comment in the comment section down below. Live chat, tap in. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you guys are tapping in the live chats because everybody that I see, you know, actually tapping in and tuning in and. You know chatting with the kid and multiple videos and stuff like that i remember everything bro so i will definitely definitely you know what i'm saying be hooking y'all up i just hooked zay trd up with a shirt that hasn't even released yet because you know he's just been showing support bro so with that being said man that's gonna wrap it up for this one like i said hit that subscribe button turn on those post notifications hit that like button drop a comment in the comment section down below and i will see y'all in the next one Peace.